So today we're gonna to be flying to Brown County Airport to prepare her for her solo pilotage flight that's gonna be happening to there. So we're gonna take off out of Claremont. We are gonna do some pilotage. She's gonna find her way there just by looking at the ground reference points that she picks out. And we're gonna practice a few landings, just do some pattern work over there. see if you've got a good overshoot on your course is take a look at what your course is and see if there's any points that it goes directly over. So we should overfly like the middle of East Fork Lake. So when we climb out at 23 and we turn to overshoot our course, let's just fly directly to East Fork and then go to our heading from there. Okay. Find a point to intersect basically. Yeah, because then you know you're right on your course if, you're, if your course goes right over a point. I, I literally haven't flown this since Saturday, so now I'm <laughs> all, all thrown up, thrown off. You're throwing up. I'm throwing up. That's how much you hate runway four. Uh, oh, I, all right. So, 2065, right rudder, off the left. Rotate. And then bring it up. That's a soft field that you're okay, doing. Okay, that's not like oh. Yeah. So if we want to climb at 60, 60, but it's okay. Just scratch that. We can go ahead and go flaps up and then just climb out at VY. I mean, it's just made as glass this morning, so you don't have an excuse as far as your altitude goes. So let's keep turning all the way yeah, towards East Fork. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yep. I didn't know it was that close, but now I see the pier in a building too. Goes and down. Get down. And then, so I'm going to switch over to the practice area. Yep. I want my nose to go down. And then we, I'll do it one more crossing over. East yeah, Fork Lake fine. to the south? Southeast. Oh. Southeast towards Brown County is what I just... Okay. So the other thing is, um, we usually want to make our first call to an airport when we're about 10 miles out. So what I do is when I'm going to an airport, airport and I'm doing pilotage, I will, or you can just do that. But um, if you didn't have a GPS, you can look to see if there's a point about 10 miles out along your route where you you kind of know you're, you're 10 miles out. Clement County 2386 Victor 2500 crossing over East Fork Lake southeast towards Brown County in Clement Practice. That's perfect call. Clement Practice area 2386 Victor 2500 just northeast of Bethel headed towards Brown County. Last call. Clement Practice. And then switch. And then now I am 10 miles out. Yep. 10 miles Brown out. for the 45 to 35? 36. 36. Yep. Brown County 2386 Victor is 10 miles northwest of the field entering a 45 downwind for 36 Brown County. Yep. Did you, okay. Yep, you got it. Okay, Bethel's off our right. And now basically a straight shot. Uh-huh. And what's pattern out? you going to be fracking? Pattern out. Yeah. Here. <laughs> it's um it's 2400 also. It's 958 cuz we're 8 840, so they're 950, so 24 and, and 19. Yeah, so 1900, because we don't need that to cross. Yeah, we're not crossing. Yeah. yeah. Um, there is a little town off to our right. I don't know if you can see it. It's 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 pretty small, but it's that's Hamersville. Okay. Uh, so when you pass Hamersville, you are five miles out. Three, okay. I should be a, well, this is the weirdest one to see, so. It is. Um, all right, so if it's three miles, going to 18 should be basically directly in front of us. I do not see it. So I see the airport environment right now, not quite the runway. So just a little bit off to the left of the nose, it's um, kind of surrounded by trees. So turn left just a little bit, and here comes the runway. Left and right, you can see a hangar on okay. the close side. Okay. Yep. Uh, Brown County 2386 Victor turning left base, runway 36, Clermont County. Where? Brown. That's going to happen. 
Um, what am I doing? I'm so I'm at 20. Let me pitch for 75. It's a new airport. <laughs> and, well, it's a new runway. We haven't landed on 36 yeah, here. Yeah, and then there's that. Brown County, 2386 Victor, turning final, runway 36. All right, pitch for 65. Pulling some power back. <coughs> pitch for 65. So there are power lines going through there, aren't there? Uh, not right, not right. No, okay, so they go here. underground. Yeah. Okay, so I see it. So we got over to Brown County and we started some patterns that we had to do go around on the very first one. Shit. Go around. Good decision. Right rudder. Stabilize. Climb. Flaps 20. Park County traffic 236 Victor is going around runway 36, staying in the pattern of Brown County. All right, now I'll go flaps in on that flaps in. Yeah, sure, you can go flaps, flaps up. up. Yeah. Ugh. That was a good go around. Like. Except for the right rudder, but good job climbing. Good job making the decision to go around in the first place. <sighs> um, I need to slow down. Um, no, I guess I'm in downwind, so that's fine. All right, I'm struggling. Power never came back to 15. It stayed at like 17 the whole time. Okay. Brown County, 2386 Victor, final runway 36. Brown County. I overshot that. Greens Greensburg traffic, Swift 82 Kilo is two miles south of entering an upwind for three. Very good landing. We'll get off at midfield. Looks like they're mowing up there. Alrighty. Oh, stop. Flaps up. Landing taxi nav and strobe. I'm shaking on that one. So the main thing, like you said, you couldn't descend. It was because we didn't bring the power back to 1500. It stayed at about 1760. Um, I I generally try to glance at my power on base and then on final too. Because sometimes we know what happens is we pull back to 1500, then the airspeed slows down and it might go down to like 1300 RPM because we slowed down. So just uh, scanning that RPM at least once from downwind to final should be something that you're trying to do. All right, we'll do another lap in the pattern here, maybe two if we have time. Brown County, 2386 Victor, back taxiing to runway 36. Full throttle, green, green, green. Everything's in the green. We are over 2065, so release, right rudder. Rotate. There Pitch you go. for 60. Yep, so up uh. even more. All right, so now clear obstacles so you can pitch down a little bit. No flaps yet. Uh. You can trim it down a That's little. That's why I'm like, yep. there's something I'm... Oh. Okay, you can go ahead and go flaps up. And nose up. I feel like I may need to widen my pattern a little bit more. Yeah, if that's what you feel like you need to do. The only because I'm overshooting, like I'm... Right. Trying to. I think that last time you had a good base, you just were trying to figure out what was wrong, and it took you a little while. To straighten out. Yeah. To be honest, her patterns really weren't that good over at Brown County. They were. She was struggling quite a bit. She got a little worked up as well, so we had to kind of work through that. Kind of freaking out when you were literally at 85 knots still. I don't know, but that's what I'm saying. Like I. I don't. I don't know, because I'm starting to, I start pitching the wrong way and then I lose it. Traffic like, this is my most complex thing right now. That, 10, so let's get 20. Brown County, 2386 Victor, turning final, runway 36, Brown County. Good, good landing. Do you think part of my, pat my pattern it needs to be bigger. Okay, that's fine. We can make crosswalk <laughs> yeah, a little longer. I, I do think that that'll help, but yeah, I, I'm just, I'm overthinking the pitching up and pitching down. I know that's what I'm doing. One thing that might be messing with you a little bit is the fact that if you're 
on the end of down when you're trying to pitch for your 85, if you make a really quick change or something, speed doesn't always change immediately when you change your pitch. So sometimes what you'll do is you'll you'll change your pitch a little bit and then be like, no, that didn't work, and then go back. You, but you need to wait a few seconds to see if, to see what your speed does after you change that pitch, because it's not going to be immediate. Do you want me to fly this next pattern? No, I'll fly it. Okay. There's a slope right there. There is a little bit. Pitch for 60. Nope, Up more. Lost it. Yeah, there you go. This is what you want to look for in a short field. Okay. Is you don't really see the horizon, yeah. And we were on downwind, and I asked her to just hand me the checklist. I didn't say what I was going to do. I just said, hey, can you hand me the checklist? All right. Can you hand me the checklist real quick? Yeah. She knew exactly what was going to happen, because somehow she's been doing this, right? First, she figured out that she was going to solo on the day. Now, I just all I do is ask for the checklist, and she just says, oh, you're going to cover something up, aren't you? You're going to block something. OK, you're just looking outside. Right? Right there. That's it. Uh, Brown County, 2386, Victor, left base, 36, Brown County. Good job. So when you turn, you tend to pull up in your turn. Yeah. So instead of doing that, try and a lighter grip on the yoke and try and just use the ailerons in that turn. Okay. Let's pitch down a little bit more. Again, you're keeping pretty much the same like attitude the whole way down. Brown County, 2386, Victor, turning final, 36, Brown County. Yeah, I went up again. Yeah, but you notice that time. Oh, I notice every time. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to do a go around because he's on the runway. Oh. Thanks, buddy. I just want you to know you nailed your airspeed to that whole pattern. Lies. The camera didn't see it, so it's lies. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. I want to stop and get out of the plane and just be like, dude, you're on a lawnmower. Get on the lawn. <laughs> Brown County 2386 Victor, turning final, runway 36, Brown County. That's fine. We can just pitch down more because we were a little fast anyway. What is he doing? Get off the runway. Way fast. Good recovery there. Let it down a little bit and then brought it back up before we touched down. See, I don't think you were way fast, so I think that your other ones were too slow. So that one felt too oh, fast. Okay. Um, but you were actually at 65 when you rounded out, and that's what we want. So. Okay. All right, when we take off from here, we'll go back to Claremont. Okay. Do you see how perfect of a pattern that was, though? Yes. Yeah? Like you have a good instructor or something? <laughs> you were just really fixating on that airspeed when you need to look outside. Brown County, 236, Victor, back taxi runway 36 for departure, Brown County. EFR flying is giving me bad habits. <laughs> That's right. Just do what you want. Just tiny airports. Nobody people cares. People riding around on the runway. All right, holding brakes. Landing, taxi, knives and stroke. All right, holding brakes. We are in the green. We're over 2065. Right rudder. Shit. Leave it. Yep. Rotate. Up higher? Higher. There, there we go. go. That's it. Okay, clear obstacle. All right, so now pitch down. Yep, and now you can go flaps up and nose up, and then you're just taking that pressure back off. Perfect, that was very good. Stupid window. <laughs> That's okay. I know, as soon as it went like this, I was like, put your hand back on the power. Yep, I was literally waiting to say leave it. It was like, no, no, I know. And it, it's one of those, like, I got to, I don't want to say I got to do it, but like, I had to be like, this is stupid. Yeah, right. Hands always on the power, like, right. oh. There we go. You can go ahead and make a last practice area call that we're passing over the dam heading back into the airport. Okay. Claremont South practice area, 2386 Victor is passing over East Fork Dam, going back to Claremont County Airport, last call. Yeah, I probably should have said more. Just altitude is the only thing, um, but you got everything else. All right, so we'll switch frequencies, and we will say that we are four miles out to cross midfield at 2300 for the teardrop. Regional traffic, uh, Skyhawk 5827 Romeo. At the airport? Yep. Wind. Holy crap. No, I'm <laughs> still looking out there. I'm like, uh, yeah. right in front of us. Yeah, nope, definitely, definitely missed that. Clement County, 2386 Victor is turning final runway for Clement County. There we go. A little better, a little fast. Okay. Pitch up a little.
blood power. Claremont County traffic, 405 Sierra Papa, 6 miles to the south. We'll join a 4 mile final for uh, runway 4. I lost Claremont. it a little bit. That's uh, okay, it was good landing still. So I think we kind of fixed that problem a little bit where she was fixating so much on the airspeed. I got her to look outside and I think that fixed it. So overall, it was a good flight. I'm glad that we were able to, to kind of fix the pattern work there before she goes on her solo. So I'm happy about that.